Hi, boys and girls. Today, we are going to learn how to multiply by 10. It's very important to memorize all of your multiplication tables from 0 to 12. But did you know that each multiplication table has its own rule? 10 is one of the easiest. All you have to do is bring the number over and add a zero to the end. One way to help you visualize this is to picture the word add on the number one and zero on the number zero. 10 times one equals 10 because one with a zero on the end is 10. 10 times two equals 20 because two with a zero on the end is 20. 10 times 3 equals 30, because 3 with a 0 on the end equals 30. 10 times 4 equals 40, because 4 with a 0 on the end equals 40. 10 times 5 equals 50, because 5 with a 0 on the end is 50. 10 times 6 equals 60, because 6 with a 0 on the end is 60. 10 times 7 equals 70, because 7 with a 0 on the end is 70. 10 times 8 equals 80, because 8 with a 0 on the end is 80. 10 times 9 equals 90, because 9 with a 0 on the end is 90. 10 times 10 equals 100, because 10 with a 0 on the end equals 100. 10 times 11 equals 110, because 11 with a zero on the end is 110. 10 times 12 equals 120, because 12 with a zero on the end is 120. 10 times 47 is 470, because 47 with a zero on the end is 470. 10 times 119 is 1,190, because 119 with a zero on the end is 1,190. To help you learn your 10 times table, you can download this template. Use this skip counting chart or this worksheet. You did a great job learning your 10 times table. See you next time. Bye.